It's day 35 and for one object a day I'm looking at the today's date, it's the 30th of April. In Vietnam, depending which side of the divide you're on, that's either the fall of Saigon anniversary or Saigon liberation anniversary. And in Vietnam, which still has a communist um, in name anyway, uh, one party state in control, the significance of the 30th of April 1975 uh, remains and is milked every single year and in fact on television there are still repeated documentaries showing grainy black and white film of the victory of the revolutionary forces over the American oppressors. And when I was living in Hanoi um, and as a journalist I had the privilege to meet an artist and unfortunately I've forgotten his name but he had spent his entire life creating revolutionary art and in line with the hammer and sickle and the iconography of communism, uh, these uh, bold socialist realist types of uh, designs were still everywhere to be seen in the 1990s. And in fact, you can still see them to this day as they fight against coronavirus. So my object for today is some original artwork. And let's just hold that up there for you. Uh, and this is an original piece of uh, original painting, uh, some artwork for a the design of a stamp to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the formation of the Vietnamese Communist Party on the 3rd of February 1930 through to the 3rd of February 1980. And it illustrates uh, two significant moments in the liberation struggle for Vietnam. Um, on the left-hand side, you have two soldiers standing over what would have been General de Castries' bunker at Dien Bien Phu, which, which was marked the defeat of the uh, French in 1954. And on the right hand side, you have a tank crashing through the gates of the presidential palace uh, in Saigon, which marked the end of the Vietnam War or the American War, uh, as they like to call it in, uh, in Vietnam. So my object for the day uh, on day 35 is a uh, piece of original artwork for a Vietnamese stamp marking the 50th anniversary of the formation of the Vietnamese Communist Party.